Welcome back. Today we're going to take a look at the top 10 Binance launch pool coins by volume. We're going to look at it by volume. We're going to start with Sui at number one, followed by Manta, Zai, Ace, AI, Meme, Radiance, Maverick, Neutron, and then we'll end it with Beam X at number 10. Let's get straight into it. Sui against BDC. So Sui is in an uptrend. So we're anticipating more upside for Sui. Now you can see that it is gaining, is gaining against BDC, which means that uh, if your coin was in Sui rather than in BDC, it should be doing well. However, if I were to assume that this is a um um, uh, an impulsive move towards the upside, right? I would consider this as a one, two. This whole thing could be a three, right? We could get a four and a five as we head higher. We are in the midst of a consolidation. If and when we are done consolidating, we will see a breakout. So I'm anticipating more upside for Sui BDC. And this is also going to translate into more upside for Sui against USD. Hmm, but we're close to the top though. Hmm, I'm not too sure myself about Sui USD. BDC pair, yes, looks good. Uh, USD pair, I wish that uh, there was some clearer chart pattern that we could trade off of, but um, yeah, it is what it is. The uh, best thing that could happen is we want to retrace. And after that, we see a rally. And after that, that's it. We break higher. A nice squeeze would be awesome for Sui, but yeah, we're going to have to wait and see how it goes, right? Volume is off the charts. 600 million, yo. Manta against BTC. Here we are for Manta. Any Manta, no, it's still a baby, it's still very new. So not much uh, information for us to work with for Manta. So we're going to have to next it for now. Uh, against USD, same thing. Not much info. So maybe after we have some squiggly candlesticks, then probably we could uh, kind of kind of uh, uh, predict where it could be going next. But for now, it's like, mm, we're not entirely sure. So yeah, but volume is a lot though. It's 300 million. 300 million. 300 million. Zai, Zai against BTC. Anyway, Zai, no. uh, we're gonna be going any higher. Again, we're not entirely sure. It's also just kind of a baby against USD. Uh, yeah, it's a higher high. Don't like this. So yeah, but we got a hammer though yesterday. So there could be some rally, but I'm not so sure if this is gonna be a strong rally. Right, we're kind of in a downwards trend. Short term, uh, could this spill into a bigger term that's again we're not sure so not much for us to work with fusion is ace against bdc here we are for ace any for ace no could this be an a b c kind of chart pattern possibly oh could we could this be an a b so what kind of a b are we gonna get is this kind is it this kind or is it this kind so we are wondering so yeah you gotta wait we gotta wait for more information for um, ace sleepers AI AI against BDC here we are for AI okay AI looks good in the small time frames if you zoom in you will see that AI is in a squeeze this is awesome uh, and I would anticipate AI to eventually break out this would be awesome right this is a very nice squeeze that's coming on so that's why the only question we have for AI when we look at it is uh, is this the bottom could we drop a little bit lower, sweep all of these lows before heading higher? Right. If you look at the daily candlesticks, mm, this was something like a hammer that came in. And after that, pump, we rose higher. Right. This was a bearish engulfing. And then pump, we drove lower. Any bullish reversal? No. Could AI still drop lower? Yeah. Uh, unless, of course, maybe we get a bullish engulfing you know, today. We just started the day like 7 hours ago. So there's still another 16 hours. Yeah, again, we're going to have to wait for more information first. Uh, against USD, AI is doing the same thing, right? Uh, against USD, okay. For Against USD, we don't have much room. Not much wiggle room. So, mm, very close to the lows here, right? If we get a very nice um, big buying candlestick over here for AI, would be awesome, but you know, still not entirely sure. So, this would be great. Consolidate a little bit. Uh, form a very nice symmetrical that's it we break higher this would be awesome but uh, we still need to see uh, the buying pressure coming for AI first meme coin meme against BTC here yeah. mm. okay we don't have a BDC pair against USD okay it's also a baby 
So are we going to get mountains here? Zip a bit lower. Plus one cent. Yeah, it's possible. Doesn't look like a reversal to me. So be very, very careful about uh, Mim. Doesn't look that good yet. Radiant Capital. Let's look at the BDC pair first. Anything for Radiant? No. Does this look like any sort of a bullish reversal? No. Not yet. Uh, maybe, maybe, you know, we might get a, a nice squeeze here. But for now, I just don't see it yet. So, mm, I preach caution here. I would preach caution. Again, look at this. Rising channel. Usually, breaks lower. So you see, we're already breaking lower. right? And there are so many clusters. Clusters here, clusters here, all the cell clusters. So whales could just zip down all the way. Sweep everybody's low over here before going back up. Again, so there is danger uh, if you were to get into Radiance at this point of time. Still no clear bullish continuation. There's no strong trend as well for Radiance. So maybe Radiant might do something like this, right? Like consolidate, accumulate a little bit longer and then maybe September, October, November, it starts blasting off. End of the year, maybe. But uh, it doesn't really look that good at the moment, right? You see volume rising close to the top. See, so, so whales, the whales have been selling. So, yeah, I mean, of course, if we consolidate over here, we could go higher, but yeah, it doesn't seem like there's anything. Not at this point of time. Maverick! Mav against BDC. Here we are for Maverick. Uh, yes, Maverick is up. I do hope that we come back down, though, to get a C. I don't see anything much at this point. Yeah, not not uh, against the BDC pair. Against USD, yeah, I know we are just like you know slowly crawling our way up, just like Radiant, right? This could be a rising channel. Rising channels usually break lower, so there could be a zip down coming on for Maverick. So yeah, be very careful. Doesn't look like there's anything. NTRN against BDC. Here we are for NTRN. Okay, that's a higher high on the price, a lower high on the MACD, lower high on the RSI. So are we going to see a reversal down? I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. I kind of like what I see here though. It's a hammer. So there could be a reversal up for NTRN. Will we get it? I don't know. Bullish engulfing. Continue a little bit higher. And then now we're dropping. Um, again, we just don't see it yet. So yeah, I preach caution. NTRN, USDT. Here we are against USD. Anything? No. But if you look very carefully, right, you can actually pull a support line up. And you can see this is a rising channel. Rising channels usually break lower. So you want to be very, 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 very careful about rushing to a trade for NTRN. Could we go higher? Of course we could. Right. Uh, but from a trading standpoint, yeah, NTRN is a no-go. Beam! X BDC. Ooh, doesn't have a BDC pair. Against USD, here we are for Beam X. Uh, this is very nice. He's a very big hammer. Right. Mm. Maybe a squeeze here. Okay, this is another hammer. So I kind of like what I see though on BMAX. Right, we might uh, revisit the resistance and then eventually break it. Right, we could do something like this. So I kind of like what I see on BMAX. Even right now on the daily, we're getting something like a hammer as well. So there is there is buying pressure coming in to push the price higher. Hm. Um, but is it tradable? Uh, it's um, not entirely sure. I don't really see the tradability of the chart pattern. Maybe on the smaller time frames we might see something, but I just don't think it's ready yet. Right. There could be a surprise move. Surprise! And then we prolonged the C, right? If this whole thing is an A up for a B, it could be coming down for a C as well. This could still drop lower. But I like the hammer though. We're gonna have to wait and see how it goes. Hmm, I would like to see this first. Maybe a retrace and yeah, we'll get in at a retrace. But for now, yeah, stay safe. We are gonna stay safe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh, ten. Okay, let's do another one. Reef. Reef BDC. Here we are for hey, you, bro. Why is it on KuCoin? Or is it on Binance? Doesn't exist. Reef against USD. Yeah, no, it's not good. Again, we're under a skinny pink line. Downwards trend. Mm. So again, I don't see anything. Mm. Stay safe. Stay safe, boys and girls. Let's do that one. Cyber! <laughs> cyber against BDC. Where's Cyber? Ah, oh, Cyber is good. Consolidating. Breaking out? Yes? No? Zip lower? Again, this could be an A, B, 
Si kind of a chave then is like, oh, you bro, <laughs> scary. Cyber against USDT. Um, yeah, okay, I like Cyber USD. Why? It, it feels like a squeeze. It's not necessarily one, but it feels like a squeeze. But uh, I don't like this, right? Very nice support line over here. Mountain, 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 mountain. I think we're gonna hit lower. I think the wheels are gonna sweep all of these lows before hitting back up. That's my guess. Uh, of course, we could also zip down here and get mountain ranges here and there. And then, so I lower. But I'm anticipating a bullish move eventually. We come back up. This whole thing could be in. A, up for B, down for C. D, something like that. Right, you can see it turned into a squeeze over here. Right, then by May, maybe, May, June, pop, we break out. Best bullish case. But of course, we have to wait for the wheels to do their thing. If you get it, great. If it um, barks like a dog, talks like a dog, uh, walks like a dog, probably is a dog. Uh, but at this point of time, <laughs> we still don't know yet. So we're waiting for more information first for Cyber. All right, boys and girls, stay safe. Uh, Bitcoin is in a retrace. I don't know whether if this is the end uh, or if there's going to be a rally. But if there's a rally, we would like to have confirmation first before doing anything. So stay freaking safe. See you in the next one. Have a great Wednesday. See you. Ta -da.